Mae'n ddeud fy clywe Chris Colgan yn gweithio. Dal i'n coed yn siŵr, falle fan y lefydd ar ôl yn y garfan, derfynol. Chi'n gweithio enwyd fel Lloyd Esgrof, yn dweud mewn Andrew Croft. Mae'n siŵr, mae gyr cynnwr fan maen nhw'n gweld i hyn mewn nhw'n ôl yng Nghafan. Ie, of course. Y mae'n hwb i ddyn nhw yn sicr. Andrew Croft sy'n bod yn hynod o anlwcus. Am rai blynyddod rhywun efo anafiadau sydd wedi golygu na dydi wedi bod yn rhan o'r garfan. Ond roedd o'n rhan yn rhan pwysig iawn o'r garfan ag o'r tîm cyn hynny. Felly cyflaidd efo ar ôl y gwaith calad mae o'n dyneud. Wrth gwrs, Lloyd Isgrof wedi bod yn sereni efo Southampton yn y tîm dan un ar hygian ac wedi cael wedi bod yn rhan o'r garfan o'r blaen. A grwan yn chwarae'n rheolaidd yn Bansley ac yn cynnig grwbath gwahanol. A dy Matthews yr un fath, mae chwarae'i wyr yma. Os nechi di wedi dod allan o'i comfort zones ac wedi mynd allan ar fenthig i glybiau er mwyn sicrhau efo nhw'n chwarae yn rheolaidd. Ac felly, yn rhoi cyflau ddyn nhw fod yn cael ei mewn i'r garfan. A mae'n rhoi cyflau ni yn y deg diwrnod yma i gael edrych arnyn nhw yn chydi bach agosach i'n weithio. So you were over in the stadiums. What was it like just being there seeing Seeing the venue, seeing what's to come. You know, he's standing there and he's looking around, the, looking at the pitch and looking at, looking around this, the stadiums itself. And you are, you, you can't help but imagine what it's going to be like, the atmosphere. You know, I, I remember being in the, the Bordeaux stadium and thinking, you know, what is it going to, you know, see a red like we had in Cyprus. And, uh, and that is, uh, you know, it's, it's mouth watering really. And then you, we went to the lawns and. Obviously, we'll play England there, and you can imagine what that's going to be like. And then uh, down in Toulouse as well. It's, uh, you know, sometimes you've got to take a step back from it and say, right, it's, it's going to be special, but we're there to do a job. Let's, we can't get carried away with it. We've got to be professional and make sure we keep our concentration. Me, more than anybody. Uh, not just think, you know, the atmosphere is going to be great. It's a great tournament and it's a celebration. It's, we're there to do the business. We're there, we're there to progress through the group. Um, but it is just mouth-watering to think we're going to be involved in it. We know how much it means to, to Wales as a nation. Uh, we've got to go there and do, do our country proud, that's for sure. Um, you're watching, you're picking the Wales squad, you're watching the other teams in the group, obviously. Is there such a thing as a day off coming up? We asked Osh the same question. It's your birthday before the day the tournament yeah. starts. I, know, yeah. uh, I take it there's no much downtime going on. No, yeah. <laughs> 25 will be. Um, <laughs> I'm sure I'll feel like that. I won't feel like that actually building into the tournament, but... Uh, no, there's once, even on a normal camp, forget the tournament, on a normal camp, these two games coming up, they're not campaign games, they're classes friendlies, but there's no friendlies, you know. It, as a staff, we, we work really, really hard and to prepare, uh, and it's constant, and it's very taxing, the way, the way we prepare and the way we work. And so we've never been to a tournament, it's our first time. I would imagine it's going to be even more intense um, so that would be interesting to see how we cope with that, but uh, no, there's not really, uh, I'm saying there's no time off. Once we're done here, I'm playing golf this afternoon, so I can't, I can't say I'm working this afternoon. I'm going to have a game of golf, but normally, most days, yeah, we're at it and we're preparing, yeah. Very honest of you. Good luck with the golf. Hope you enjoy the next few Thanks, weeks. Thanks, yes. Thank you. Thanks.